हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल मैं हजार को लगी फेर भी एट भिडियो लेकर आई सकते मैं अस्त भे तब बंग्लादेश भिडियो आई एम सरी गाइज मैं हिजो हाल पाएन है गाइज विविध कारण मेरे ये थोड़े काम ने मैं हिजो हाल पाएन गाइज तेल आज हाल होप गाइज इंजोय द भिडियो अप सपोर्टिंग गाइज है सपोर्ट कर जे भाई हम टीम डीआरएस अलग एकदम राम खेले रहे मैं बंग्लादेश में गए राम खेल रहे अभी अर्क भिडियो अर्क भिडियो मोलि तीर हाल गाइज अलग ये भिडियो हाल है ये भिडियो हिजो हाल पर्ने भिडियो वास्तव में टाइम न भर चाहिए इसो हाल न हाल न गाइज ओके गाइज लाइक सेयर सब्सक्राइब से अनिवार्य कर दिन होगा गाइज हाई तपोर्ट कर दिन होगा गाइज ये भाई अलग लेट्स इंजोय द भिडियो गाइज Simpio Gelson. Four players have tried to support the players of TSB Esports. Leo Esports was eliminated by TSB Esports. TSB Esports. Leo Esports are dropping. Uh, they drop. They are dropping uh, in Gatka since a long time. They're a pro team. They played PMSL qualifier. They are. They have participated. The players of Leo Esports have participated in PMPO Papua World Pro League. And we have been eliminated in the process as well. Right now, we're looking at nine teams and twenty-one players as of now. Playbook Esports. Their vehicles are already spotted from the player Killer YG, and DRS will definitely try to confirm some more elimination points. NRM Atomic. He was taking a lot of damage. Incas. He was taken down by his own grenade. Trix needs to come quickly, and then maybe he can go to the revival process. But what will happen to Ninja? Ninja already confirmed the kill from Incas, but not so lucky because HC tricks with the another confirmation. No, that was not it, I guess. Some other guy took the kill from NRM Ninja, and yes, the team is completely eliminated from this lobby. Right now, we have only eight teams, and all the teams will get at least some playing towards the circle. Bia, bia, bia. He will be there. Uh, is holding the complete information about the circle. We are already inside top six right now, and uh, inside the top six teams. And uh, just look at A2C Legends. They're they're at the bottom team according to the tournament uh, point table, but still they are fighting. Still they are fighting with their best effort, and they have confirmed already two elimination points in this match. Dear Killer Whitey, he is moving forward. Killer Whitey, he is very hungry about taking the kills. He needs that title of most valuable player of the tournament, and that's why he is trying to ki uh, kill all of the enemies who are. Um, not in a good, very good position against him. Uh, just look at Marcelo. Marcelo, uh, he is trying to uh, spot the enemies. So far, his performance is uh, very good. I don't know who is this guy, who is this lad, but whoever it is, he is playing really good. And from the comment section, from the chat box, we were watching. A lot of people were appreciating the performance of Marcelo as well. Let's see, Killer White. He is moving forward. He is going towards ZCDT Xerox. ZCDT Xerox. Uh, they need to come. They need to come back. They have total 12 missing points. But in this scenario, they are facing the greatest team in this lobby. They are facing one of the strongest teams in this lobby. That is DRS Gaming for now. Killer White. He will be joining his teammates. Snorlax. He has the highest information. He's playing in the front line. Obviously, let's talk about DRS Snorlax. We already know Killer Whitey and Sandesh, but what will happen to the rest of the players? DRS is actually giving us a little bit of hints about which these players are. I've uh, uh, like I've gotten some information, but the audiences are really speculating a lot of uh, player names, and we've seen some great examples on this comment section. But still, I guess DRS is actually making some very, very, very big changes in terms of their roster uh, supports and everything. So I hope they'll be able to perform even better in the upcoming official tournaments. They have what it takes. They have the strong support from the uh, side of the viewers. And yes, the Nepali team, DRS, one of the strongest, one of the most beloved team. Definitely, they are going to pick some great, talented players. Let's see. Right now, they're taking a fight against ZCTT Xerox, another underdog team from Bangladesh. And recent times, 
Uh, at recent times, they're actually doing great. Let's see if they can win it or not. Yes, see, the, the, uh, TT Xerox has won the fight. They have six eliminations in total, and already Sixa will get one fight. Anything is possible. Killer, he has received a lot of damage against Tri Baramis and Tri Baramis. Made a comeback. They made a statement, and they are coming uh, back on the team leaderboard. And that's how they secured the winner with a chicken and a tribe. And we see they were holding the second page of the point table. They were at hashtag 13. But with this match, with this match, tribe and we see definitely they were 22nd minute, but still they were not able to take the chicken at home. That was really unfortunate. AST with 19 points right now. They are climbing up on the ladder one by one. But what will happen to the rest of the squads? ZCT Xerox with 14 points. Ozja with 10. But the remaining to wait a little bit. Let's see what will happen to the MVP ranking board if anything is going to change. I guess not too much of a change is coming as of now. Killer White is still holding his first position. And then after that, we are looking at Leo Hyde Dummy. He's climbing up a little. Then we have PBE, uh, Playbook Esports, Michi, and Monboy. Let's inspirational story for now. Let's look at the overall ranking, overall standings after 11 match. We can see DRS Gaming still holding the top position with 115 points. In every match, they are playing really, really good. Oja Esports, they are here with total uh, 87 points. Just one points, um, one point difference between Oja Esports and Leo Esports. Also taking a little bit damage, not too much. They were not in a very bad situation as of now. But DRS, they're finally getting the first elimination from this uh, uh, fight. Let's see. Already they have one elimination. They need to get some more. Toxic OP from OG, Optimal Genesis. They are also getting hammered by the players of T2K. Already another knock came through. But maybe this guy will get revived. Toxic OP will not have any big issues. Problem is they don't have the vehicles to work with. Trying to retaliate with that with that fight, Snorlax was taken down. Teaser, he's also taken down by Marcelo. Just look at the HP of Sandesh. He needs to revive his teammate. He need, needs to activate his teammate once again. Obviously, it's Sandesh and Snorlax. They are over here right now. This team has three elimination already. DRS Killer Whitey was the guy who didn't get any elimination points from now. But FSX, so they have what it takes. They were able to get the elimination against DRS in the previous match. So definitely, they will try to get this uh, chicken dinner once again. They will try to finish off DRS Gaming once again. But Sandesh, right now, he's just moving with his vehicle, trying to bait the enemy. But that bait was not taken from the FSX lineup. On the other hand, Poison was already taken down by marcelo with the opening knockout against team secret rain they will definitely confirm this elimination point without any sort of any hesitation on the other hand let's talk about sandesh once again yes uh, mr adi is on a very 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 troublesome position right now and right right now they have to move inside killer whitey was taking the confirmation keen he was also taken down by the evil army warrior fsx so they're not having the best possible position because uh, one by one they're also losing their players Obviously, for now we are inside already. Already inside top two of teams right now. Every team is fighting, and just look at the kill tally of the teams. Not a lot of teams are surviving with their full roster. Jesse Rizrox is alive with their only one player, PBE one player, Exo one player. They're really struggling about that. Killmonger secure hide dummy. Leo Esports they are losing one of their teammates uh, once again, and four death machines they are completely wiped out after a long time. We are watching. Another team is eliminated. DRS Gaming, a very, very constructive fight, a very, very decorated fight. Let's see. Snorlax is taken down. FS Axo and Acid. In that case, Acid was taken down in the retaliation. Instant trade knock, instant team game. A very wonderful team game is coming up from. He attacked Suyok perfectly. Now he is looking towards DRS Gaming. Sometimes he is taking care of about. Uh, T2K sometimes he is taking care about DRS gaming the two giant teams has been taken care of by him right now T2K Sandesh he is facing a lot of trouble uh, uh, now he's playing with DRS gaming right now top se uh, seven elimination have been secured by DRS killer whitey he's not stopping his vehicle he's just trying to run over one of the players of the evil army but the evil army they are not spotted yet by killer whitey Obviously, Killer YT. Killer YT. Oh, no, no, no. There was another vehicle, but Killer, he was taking a very, very, very big risk, and that's why he was eliminated from this position. Warrior. 
the guy who is trying to confirm the kill and yes he was able to take this elimination home on the other hand let's talk about the remaining three players from drs gaming they can't believe themselves because already the star player from this lineup drs killer white he was already eliminated on this battleground the, the remaining three right now it is up to their task let's see if they can pull it off and take this chicken dinner home uh jackpot kamil virus there over here as well kamil virus still in a tight position tight location already they've spotted igneous but it's all up to virus let's see if he can clutch it out or not rampage came from marcelo already this guy has five elimination and yes he will try to get some more right now they're on the top three og right now surviving with only one player jane might be taken down with a grenade from virus and that was a picture perfect grenade right now jane trying to leave from the scene let's see igneous he, if he can get into the trouble as well already he's surviving with bare minimum hp somehow he's still alive but not in a very good position gsm virus he's in a big troublesome area as well maybe marcelo can peek him out and if he can peek this player then definitely virus will not see another day already a grenade is flying towards this guy and, and surviving with bare minimum hp virus is trying to heal up once again virus is trying to get an another kill gsm virus he is surviving all alone it's a two versus two versus one fight anyone can take the winner winner chicken dinner and just look at marcelo he's already spotted by virus but virus will wait he will wait for the conclusion sandesh he is already getting some knock and t2k they're serving with one of their players and that is ignis ignis is a solo player there is marcelo they cannot make any risky move they cannot take a very risky situation so that's why igneous uh he is going for the revive process so he he should get the revive but the problem is deer is is getting the zone control t2k they are outside the zone they have to use a lot of smoke support let's see how they can utilize it it's late to get igneous and suyok right now they have to move inside but the zone is really not supporting these players already virus is trying to heal up but sandesh and marcelo Right now they have to fight against t2k as well so they're in a very 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 troublesome position but somehow virus he was already spotted by sandesh and sandesh was taking no time at all they have already confirmed this elimination point this can be a 15 kill chicken dinner for drs gaming but still they have to wait it out t2k they're trying to use these grenades and if these grenades are successful then maybe it can be a chicken dinner for drs lineup as well already sandesh with the opening knockout last guy suyuk b2 he was Spotted as well, and already the kill uh, coming for DRS Gaming. 15 elimination chicken dinner. Huge start for this lineup. A great, great, great chicken dinner on the Erangel match. What a what a game for DRS Gaming. And uh, just look at that. With that match, with that point, they will uh, they will be having a long, long lead over the other teams. Oja Esports T2K. They will need to struggle a lot now. Uh, but DRS Gaming, they're having a very good time. Especially in Irangal match, DRS, they are sort of unbeatable for now. Obviously, they are just unbeatable. Too much to handle for all the other teams. Congratulations. Already, we're looking at all these players. But it was Sandesh who was the MVP because of his outstanding performance. Six elimination. And he got the last two important elimination. And he got the most damage, I suppose. That's why he is on top of Marcelo. Already six elimination with 897 damage. Two assists, 290 healing. And longest elimination distance was 120 meters. So we're just taking the mid-ranges fight. No long-range fight or uh, like whatsoever. That was not coming from this guy, Sandesh. He was doing great and his team is really 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 happy right now they are getting a lot of points they already have more than uh like 100 points already and after this match rising uh that surprise attack inside the smoke when drs gaming was trying to run over the team that was really amazing 25 points have been secured by drs from the first match t2k they are holding hashtag two with total 13 elevation points only two teams have confirmed the double digit only two teams have touched the double digit but no one else could uh, make it to the double digit points. Okay, will Army, eight points, Leo, seven. Got eliminated. After that, we'll talk about the MVP ranking, most valuable player rankings over here. And as you guys can see, DRS Killer White is still holding his top position, but Leo High Dummy is really close and after the next match maybe he can surpass killer yt once again same can be said about t2k jane michi he can take the center stage as well and we have to talk about marcelo even though his face was not shown in the uh like overall screens or whatsoever on the matches but still he is doing wonderful 
him. Overall standings, we can see DRS Gaming at the top position of 140 points. No competition, no competition is uh, happening with DRS Gaming. T2K Sports, 94 points. Leo Esports, 93 points. Here we can see a very tough competition between T2K and Leo Esports. Just one point difference between them. Anja Esports, they are facing a lot of trouble. That's why they are falling down bit by bit. They are having a uh, total 87 points for now. Playbook Esports, they have confirmed total 75 points, 73 points for his HCVZ Rocks. Obviously, 75 for uh, 73 for ZCD Rocks, 70 points for FSX. So they are losing their momentum quite a bit. On the other hand, let's talk about Four Death Machine, Evil Army, and Tribe Aeromissy. Even though Tribe Aeromissy was doing great on the first game, still they were eliminated at the first couple of seconds, first couple of minutes on this Erangel match. After that, whichever name you want to call him, this guy is over here with us. And right now, they are going to take a fight against TSB. Killer YT also taking another important knockout. Another guy was taken down. And Inumi, he was also taken down. Killer YT, he's trying to confirm these elimination points. But the last guy... Raids Sung, I guess, uh, uh, sorry, Rai Sung, he was trying to go away from this fight, but no, he can't, I guess. Already his footsteps are uh, being spotted by Sunday. She will try to confirm this elimination point. Let's see if something happens or not. No, nothing. Already four kills are being taken by DRS Gaming. Marcelo was the guy who got the final kill with a win 94. That was a very, very, very quick move from Marcelo. And yes, guys, already TSB is the first team to get wiped out from the lobby. Obviously, for the M4 Death Machine's peak, uh, he is taking some damage from Claw, but Claw, uh, he he was supported by his teammate Liquid X, got the first knock, got the initial knock, Killmonger, he's going towards Claw. Somehow, he's going towards the player of uh, Le uh, Leo Esports, Liquid X. Claw, he's trying his best to provide the support, but Ajaya, he needs to go there as soon as possible, and Liquid, he will try to de uh, delay knock with his sniper action. Miramar, he, this is the haven for snipers. This is the haven area of all of the long range players. And um, sniping, definitely, this is an art, a piece of art. So let's see how teams are react according to that. Uh, team 4 Death Machines, they are just taking the control of the bridge. And here is gaming. They are trying to fight against them from a, an upper angle. Pirate was spotted, but Pirate, he is not picking for a long time that that was a very short pick and that's why DRS gaming is facing uh, a bit trouble they need to be cautious they need to be very very careful about that they cannot afford any knock at this time DRS gaming this can be another win win chicken dinner for them just look at the mini map definitely DRS gaming might take the chicken in their home as they have three more members remaining right now they just have to wait and all the other teams will come to the DRS lineup and then they can get those skills accordingly. Right now, Bia, yeah. Zio, HC Tricks, and Incas GMLY. These are the survivors of this fight, of this Miramar match. But let's see who will survive till the end. Some of the kills are not being taken by the uh, teams who are actually participating on this match. Obviously, here is Gaming Sandesh. Uh, he will try to get a knock with his grenades. Pop Pop is taken down by Killer Whitey. Sandesh, one versus one against Teaser. Teaser, he is just taking the cover. He's not picking from that uh, situation. Teaser must know that a grenade is coming from the side of Sandesh. He must anticipate that, and that's why Teaser was moving from that fight. But uh, he, uh, Sandesh, he is taken down by Tricks. Tribe Arrow missing, got one more points. There is gaming. They are just losing the control. They are just losing the control after that knock of Sandesh. Pound OP. He got another knock. Uh, he will try to secure that kill. Killer YP, he has taken the control of the warehouse area. Bahunopi is completed by, completely taken down by Skyden. Obviously, guys, let's go back to uh, DRS Gaming once again. They have the zone control. Still, they're in a very, very, very good position. But the problem is, Killer YT will not have the support of Marcelo on this match. On the previous matches, we were looking at Marcelo and Killer. They were supporting one another very, very, very uh, good. And right now, if the support is not here for Killer YT, maybe it's all up to him. He will try to survive till the end, fighting it out all alone. Maybe he will get uh, some more good elimination points from here. If he can get more than five, that will be a huge deal because already he was in a great lead compared to the other players. Let's see if he can get the final some uh, final elimination points as well. Right now, Killer White, he's over here with 
uh, his M416 and with the 6x he's trying to find those players from uh, the deep D lineup. The two players were just lying down casually and AST Zio was the guy who spotted the players already. FSX for teaser had a very important knockout. Incas and Biap, two guys were knocked out. Sandesh knocked out another one. Teaser, he's going for the one versus one. Zio, he needs to wait it out. Let's see, an another grenade. Once B1, and Zio won the fight with that UMP45. That was a great move. Once again, Zio is the only one at DRS. They're taking the final kills. This is a very bad move from Zio. Right now, he can go for that one versus one. That was a very important knockout. And right now, going for the first aid kit, he will go for the next couple of attacks. Sandesh versus Zio. Okay, 1v1. Zio still using the first aid kit. One versus one against Sandesh. Killer White is a little too far away. That's why Zio was having a little bit of a chance. But I don't think that will be possible because at the end, it was Sandesh who got the final kill. Sandesh or XMPL, whichever name you want to call him. Still, he is going to take the last elimination, the greatest elimination, the most important elimination from this match. The last kill was taken by this guy. Congratulations to DRS team for taking another winner winner chicken dinner. Huge matchup for the squad. What a performance. What a team DRS Gaming. And uh, DRS Gaming, uh, I, I heard that they're cooking something. Whatever they are cooking, that is very spicy. That is that. That's gonna be very, very interesting. And we're just waiting for it. And uh, just before the PMSL land, that will make a boom. That's for sure. After 14th match, um, I guess uh, DR is gaming. After a few match, we, we will, uh, we can unofficially announce the championship title of this tournament, how DR is gaming is playing. Every every team is uh, fighting for the second position now. No one is looking about the championship. Uh, how DRS Gaming is performing? Yeah, definitely. I mean, they're on top of everyone else. They have a huge lead compared to the other teams. So that means this will be a like good event for the squad. And I hope Ma in match ranking we can see DRS Gaming. They have a secret total twenty one points. As you all know. DTD, they are here with 14 points, 4 elimination points, and 10 uh, 4 placement points, and 10 elimination points. They were playing really aggressive from the starting of the game. A player, Killer YT, he's just killing this lobby. 169 points after 14 match. We have total 6 matches left from now and uh, today uh, we will be watching one more match today uh, that will be in Irangal. Leo Esports, uh, they secured total 112 points, but will that be enough to compete with DRS Gaming? Ozra Esports secured total 107 points, T2K Esports uh, secured total 98 points. No changes in the top four positions after the previous match. That's it, it is Xerox secured total 77, Ace Commander 71 points. Obviously, guys, just uh, if we look at the bottom of the taken. They will have some chance to loot this uh, loot crates, and after that, they can get inside the circle. The circle is definitely a little too far away, so they will need some vehicle to work with. Then they can get inside the zone without any sort of hesitation or whatsoever. Let's talk about Sandesh once again. He was taken down, and already HKM. They're taking some more fights. Killer YT with the opening knockout against Zeklab Esports. Let's see who wins over here. Levi was the guy who was taken down completely. Bad move. From ZC, Nightwing was also taken down. Back to back fights are happening. ZC Memo, right now, he's over here. Let's see who wins from this fight. Snorlax, he was trying to fall back a little. Snorlax, this guy is Gayante. Okay, that's the confirmation we have seen from the uh, POV from this guy. But let's see, he's going for the revival process once again. And Nade is coming. But let's see, this grenade can be decisive. Killer YT was taken down already. Once again, he's in deep trouble. The position is not really good for DRS Gaming for the revival process. Marcelo, he's a little too far away and he's trying to fight it from a different angle, different location. Different angle, different location. DRS Gaming Snorlax, he is trying to make another angle for now. Uh, and Snorlax, that was an incredible knock against Fear. Fear was taken down. Let's see how Memo gonna handle this fight. It's a 2 versus 1 scenario. That was an incredible jump shot. That was almost impossible to fight against. ZC Sports, they're completely eliminated right now. And uh, we're watching top 11 teams fighting for the best location, best position for now. Uh, we can see not Zoo. He's eliminated, he's knocked out, and Cyclone, he's also taken down by Michi. 
Obviously, DR is Snorlax, uh, Killer YT, Marcelo. These three players are still surviving, but the Z Club Esports, they were not really lucky from this fight. They were eliminated. Killer YT was revived once again. He was taken down two times, but still, Z Club Esports were not really the team who was taking the eliminations from this enemy side. PBE, Playbook Esports, they are also taking some more fights, and already HK Murderers are getting hammered down by this squad. HK Murderers has been eliminated. And Playbook Esports, they have five eliminations so far with one member knocked out currently. So he will get revived in a little bit. No worries about that. But they need to move in quickly. They need to get ready for the next couple of fights. Playbook, Jaril and the remaining ones already, they are getting ready for the fight. But still, they have FS Exo to deal with. So they have FS Exo. FS Exo, they will try their best. FS Exo did not uh, confirm. Uh, they will try to get inside a a little bit deeper playbook esports they have the vehicle controls with that situation as well obviously guys let's just talk about drs snorlax just waiting over here to find out some more enemy players maybe amir bhav will get spotted but before that snorlax had a little bit of a troublesome position right now he was taking a little damage from fsx so keen i suppose but keen he was not spotted the exact angle of uh keen was not spotted by the player snorlax he's just waiting over here to get the better view from the enemy player but once again they'll try to move away from this position right now they don't want to get into any sort of trouble obviously they will not uh, they will not uh, they don't want to face any sort of trouble they have to be very cautious about that they have to be very careful about that and DRS gaming Snorlax, killer yt marcelo they have three players uh, in their hand in irangal match DRS is one sort of unbeatable and uh, that that is what will be uh, inspiring them. So let's see. Let's actually sports teaser. They are holding the deep for now and waiting for the zone shift. The fourth circle shift. If it's exo getting a little bit of zone support, not a much, but uh, DRS gaming versus this exo sports. Let's see when the fight will begin. Obviously, viewers right now getting ready for another one. Another fight is coming up. As and and you guys and as you guys can see, teaser and the remaining ones right now they're getting ready. Teaser, he's in a total different position, but right now he has to fight against the players of 4DM. Right now we have eight young X was taken down already, and his skill will be taken by the player of uh, DRS. No legs will confirm another elimination point. This team has five kills as of now, but 4DM doesn't have any. CDD and 4DM both teams have four players remaining with all their players, all their survivors, still they're in a bad position because right now they were not in the circle at all. 4DM, Pirate was already taken down. FSX or Teaser might come from the elimination point, but once again, Killmonger was taken down. Right now, Peak is the only one who is surviving and he will try to revive him, uh, his teammates first, then then they can go back into the fight once again. Here is Gaming Killer YT trying to trace that enemy from FSX to Esports. FSX Esports pushed directly towards that compound, that solo compound. The kill will be secured if they uh, utilize this opportunity properly, but they cannot go outside. They cannot uh, stay outside that compound. If they do that, the RS Gaming will be there to punish them uh, ASAP. Uh, Mafia Punk, he's also taken down. DTD and uh, DRS Gaming, they are also taking fight. DRS Gaming taking a long split, just like T2K. They uh, how they like to do it, and that's why take fight against FSX Sports if they need it. Definitely, FSX is still surviving with three of their members. Let's see who will win from here. PBE Monboy Lest, he's just waiting over here with a very good position as of now, but he is coming into a very bad position in my opinion because there are players in front of him from the team DRS already holding a very good position right now. Monboy Lest, he needs to go for the direct frontal attack. Let's see who wins from this position, and right now, Monboy will try to first aid uh, himself once again. Let's see who will win over here right now. There is Killer taking another knock against Michi, so it's all up to this guy, Monboy, but he was also eliminated. Marcelo took another very important finish. Already this team has 9 kills, and right now they are at top 6. Let's see who wins till the end. Right now we are looking at Killer. Rifat was already taken down. Killer will be the final player who will try to survive as long as he can, but the problem is he has one player from NRM who has already spotted Abban. And the remaining guys from NRM Esports is already spotted player. Let's see who will win from this uh, fight. Abban right now, he needs to use some smokes. Otherwise, he's, otherwise he might get spotted from the enemy players. 
Obviously, right now, NRM Esports, Abban and Ninja Bay, Ayman, they will try to hold from this area. Uh, mid, uh, mid game was not that much of intense, but at the later part of the game, we can see a lot of teams are surrounding towards that hillside area. They are trying to take the fight. Ninja Bay, uh, how he will be initiating that fight. Killer Whitey taken down. Keen, Keen was uh, immediately finished. FS Actor Esports. TRS Gaming was very much aware about that. Killer YT secured one more kill. He has secured total three elimination points in this match as well. TRS Gaming is in a very good touch. What a knock from his side. Laser like performance is like there is no recoil he is facing. FSX with Esports. Teaser. He's just uh, falling back from that fight. Another headshot was connected. And uh, that's how DRVS killer YT secured total five elimination points. 13 kills have been secured by DRVS. And uh, in uh, Irangel match, DR is as like as we said, they are kind of an unbeatable team. But the problem is, problem for DRS is dreams to destination. They are surviving with their full roster intact. Obviously, guys, we are back on top five and three squads are on here with only one single member. So let's see who can survive till the end. That will create some more possibilities. Skynin, he has confirmed some very, very, very good knockouts and finish. Ozja right now surviving with only one player. Skynin, let's see how long he can survive on this fight. He was already ruling on top of everyone else at the MVP kill leaderboard. Let's see if he can get some more kills and secure the first position or not. Right now, we're down to the top three teams. Let's see. One player from NRM, Abban, is trying to get inside the circle. Maybe he will not be that lucky and already he was eliminated. Let's see. It will be a one versus three. DRS already. They have two impressive chicken dinners. Can they go for the third? They have taken this chicken dinner. That is great, great, great. Huge performance. A huge performance from their side. What a match. What a match they have completed. And uh, what a style of ending the day. DRS Caving. They have they are having the highest number of winner winner chicken dinner. In this time, uh, the game is kind of one-sided against DRS Gaming. They are playing with the uh, uh, Killer YT Marcelo. Oh my god, what a team. Though this is not that Marcelo who we are watching, but uh, they are gaming, they are playing really good, really, really good. Probably they will have more than 50 lead in the overall ranking. Already the MVP, none other than Killer YT, because of his outstanding performance, he has seven eliminations just from this match. Already he was ruling on top of everyone else, but on this match, he did another uh, another amazing performance with seven elimination and 983 overall damage. He was doing wonderful. One assist, 315 healing, and the longest elimination distance from his side was 147 meters. That was great. Right now, let's talk about the DRS and the remaining three teams who were in the top four. Ozja, ZCT, Xerox, and DTD. In terms of overall points, they are here on the top four uh, slots. Right now, let's talk about Ozja with only one player surviving till the end. Skynin did wonderful. And then after that, we're looking at ZC TD Xerox. TD Xerox were surviving uh, with two members, Rifat and Killer. They were doing great as well. Then after that, we're looking at DTD Dream to Destination with the most amount of distance travel, the most amount of smoke thrown compared to all the other teams. Still, they were trying to survive for a long time. They had they were at the second position overall. DRS with 26 points. They're on top. Then after that, we have to talk about Ozja with 14 points. They're second. ZC TD Xerox with 11 points. DDD and PBE. With 10 points each, four teams are getting, uh, four, four, sorry, my bad, five teams are getting at least 10 or plus points. Five teams are getting double digit points. NRM Sports secured total six uh, points, plus, and five points are coming from the placement points. One is from uh, elimination points only. Z Club Esports took total five elimination points, but no rank points for them. A2C Legends, four. 3 for EXO and 4 DM. They also seek out total, three total points. Okay, what about the rest of the player? The problem is some of the teams were not able to get a single point from this match as well. So that's a little bit too harsh for these teams. Maybe, maybe, maybe they will be able to come back strongly. But still, this is a very tough call. I don't know if this, this will be possible or not. Still, we have to wait a little while. We have to wait till the 
last day the remaining five matches will show us who will win this tournament or not guys you have seen all the information but the problem is getting bigger and bigger for team once he is competing with himself no one is beside him no one is uh, near him at all michi he has secured total 31 points which was 5781 5, elemental points and uh, if you talk about the survival points killer yt is uh, far 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 away from a lot of players 20 minutes and five seconds ever survival time hey guys let's talk about the mvp ranking and after that we are looking at drs gaming with just playing 15 matches they have 195 and five chicken dinners huge 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 like they have taken one third chicken dinner already from the top 15 uh the, the top teams they have taken five chicken then after that we're looking at osja and the remaining ones but what is going on with the second page optimal genesis and nrm they're trying to come and uh, they have to be careful about their chicken dinner placement points as well performer of the day that is killer white without any doubt in every match he performed really well from five match he has secured total almost 20 eliminations that means his, his average in every point is very match is very 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 good total survival time is 22.55 that was even better than yesterday definitely team contribution is getting higher and higher by each and every day right now he is at 35 percent overall great performance from a team uh drs killer yt i hope in the upcoming day he will be